Hey YouTubers and welcome back to another episode here on ESGN Net of MLB 16 The Show, Road to the Show with Simon Unger. This is episode 150 and we're getting ready for this series here against the Arizona Diamondbacks here. Actually, yes, uh, we'll be the Diamondbacks here today in this uh, series as uh, we're getting closer and closer to the end of the season here, getting close to the playoffs and of course... Uh, We've uh, already been we've clinched the division uh, title, and now we're just playing to see uh, what we can do here and uh, probably get some of uh, those September call-ups there involved <clears throat> in the game, getting them some experience here. Take a look at Simon's numbers here now. Of course, uh, those are not the teams that he's been a part of. Uh, you, the first team right there says KC, but it really should be Minnesota. And then, of course, the... Uh, what was a TR there uh, or TB uh, should be uh, sh should be for uh, the Blue Jays should be Toronto uh, he played for Toronto for there for a while and then it says Colorado there he's never played for Colorado it should be <laughs> should be uh, the LA there for the Dodgers uh, so yeah it's there's a glitch there uh, hopefully they'll fix that in the next game here but. Take a look at uh, his stats there against the Diamondbacks, and he's actually been pretty successful here against the Diamondbacks, uh, especially here at Chase Field. So we'll see what Simon can do today. As you see, there 102 and 51 going against the Diamondbacks, 81 and 71 record. It's just 82 and 71 there for the season. So there are 20-something games behind us here, and we shouldn't be too worried about them. But you know, you never know what happens. So. Go to the top of the second here with the runners at first and second. And Simon Unger is up to bat here with a 1-0 count. And that's going to drop out there. That is going to fall down. But that will get uh, not caught by the left fielder there. But the runner from second will go ahead and slide in for the score. And it will be safe. And that will be a uh, RBI double there for Simon Unger. As he knocks one in to the ball game here today. As McCarthy is just uh, dejected with himself here. He's given up three hits already and now a run here in the ballgame. Now we go to the seventh inning here. 6-2. Uh, Diamondbacks have a good lead here. And Simon Unger swings and misses on that pitch there. And that right there is going to send him back to the dugout. Now go to the ninth here. 8-3. We do pick up a run here. And uh, so do the Diamondbacks here. Actually, they pick up two after the the uh, there the last time we see him, but we'll see here. Simon Unger hits this one high and deep, and that goes over the wall. That's a three-run shot there, and I believe this is somewhere around home run sixty something. I forgot now, but yeah, that's a three-run shot there for Simon Unger. It puts it now at a ball game here of eight to five. They're getting back in this ball game here. But is it a little too late to have them win this one? Uh, we'll have to find out and see. But see, Simon Unger just slugs that ball right out of the ballpark there. No problem there for him as they end up losing this ball game. Eight to five is your ball game. Two for five for ball Simon Unger here with a single and a double there. And of course, that home run, which was a three run jack. Nice job there from Unger. So now we'll see here. We do pick up another. Uh, we pick up a loss, or we uh, end up picking up a loss. And now we got Clayton Kershaw on the hill here today. Almost a guaranteed win as he has a 19 and 2 record. Simon Unger 0 for 1. He popped out in the first inning here. The Dodgers lead it by 1 here. As we'll see what Unger could do here with his pitch here. This is the first pitch of the inning. And we'll see here. He'll go after this one and hit this one right up the middle here. As that will be a base hit for him on here. And hopefully he can get something going here for himself here today for the Dodgers. Not fall behind like they did in the last game. So Yashiro Pui coming up. One for one. He's doubled in a home or doubled in an RBI already in this ball game. As we'll go ahead and see what he is going to do they're going to go ahead and take off here and that is going to be down and that is going to be a not a stolen base here he will get caught there and i have a questionable call on this one i think simon unger was there he went head first here we'll take a look here see where the ball's at and i don't know that one looks like he got there on time but the rump says no so we'll go to the fifth inning here 
We'll see a 7-2 ball game here as Simon Eggers up to bat once again here. And he will go ahead and knock this one. That's going to be a line drive past the first baseman there going out of the first base line. And that will be a nice hit. So runner from first goes to third there. Nice job to make an advance that way. And getting himself in scoring position here. Now Puig will be up to bat here. One for two now here for him as he is going to be trying to see if he can hit one deep. But Simon Unger will get caught in that cut, that uh, run down there. And that's another uh, caught stolen here. As uh, really truly, I think that should have been more of a pickoff. But they say it's a stolen base. We'll see here. Diamondbacks win this one. 8-4 to four is your final score. As Simon Unger now has 66 home runs here for the season. And uh, he's just uh, really just really belting these balls around the ballpark. So that's two losses now here against the Diamondbacks, and that's going to help them gain some more space here up the rankings here in the National League uh, West. But, of course, really, truly, they can't really take it because we've already taken it already. So go to the, the first inning here. We'll see what Simon can do as he hits this one. The second baseman cannot make a play there. He dives after that one, and that's going to give Simon Unger a base hit. So nice job there from Unger getting the base hit. And we'll see what we can do here. To, actually, it's just a Matt Kemp this time around. What he can do here to help Simon Unger out. So you see Matt Kemp's numbers both home and away. It looks like he's more better at being at home here. But we'll see that, uh, that it will be another good strike out there. And uh, they'll have, or excuse me, a good walk. So we'll go ahead and walk, uh, not strike out, but they will go ahead and walk Kemp. So now we have runners at first and second. Butler's up to bat now with the runners in scoring position here as he has a 3-1 uh, count in his favor. And we'll see here with two outs. Unger's going to go ahead and take off here, and Unger slides and gets in there. Yes, he does. That's a stolen base, and that will be a uh, great stolen base. There, as you take a look here at the replay and see, yeah, you got, nope, you know, you didn't get a have. So we'll see here next at bat with the uh, runners at first and, or third, excuse me, at second and third. And we'll see that Billy Butler cannot do anything, or I should say the same at bat, but Billy Butler cannot do anything there as uh, they'll go ahead and walk him there. Now the bases are loaded. So bases are loaded here. And the Dodgers would love to get a runner across the plate as a 1-1 count here. And that will be a hit ball there to the first baseman. And that will be it as Anthony, uh, or excuse me, as uh, the for our first baseman will go ahead and tag the back. Now we'll see here at one nothing next at bat here for Simon Unger as he finds his pitch. And he'll rocket this one out to right field there. That will be a base hit. And that will leave him there at first. And take a look at the averages coming in here. And Simon is one of the uh, best there. So, yeah, he's in first place there uh, behind some pretty good names there helping him, that are behind him. Puig is there. He's on the list there. So uh, not really surprising. But, um, you know, uh, we'll see uh, as the season is really winding down here. We'll see Simon Unger get off the back here just a little bit here, thinking about stealing here. And he goes ahead and says, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and steal. And this is going to be thrown, and that is going to be a stolen base. Okay, so how could this one be a stolen base? Because honestly, I thought he was going to be gunned down. But the original the one he uh, ran earlier, they said he was out. Okay, maybe because he maybe spinned or dived away from it or whatever. But, yeah, I don't know. That... That, on that angle there, it looked like he was safe, but the original angle, he didn't look like he was safe. So, we'll see here. Simon Unger looking to see where this ball's at, and no, he cannot advance. As that was nicely caught there from the center fielder. Nice play there. As, uh, yeah, he really played in the uh, hands there. As you see there, just diving off there. Superman catch there on that play. So Simon's still stuck at second here. He's looking for a hit here to get him home and try to score from second. As we'll see here, this will be a ball, and that is going to be 
a caught stealing a third uh, still in third base. Go to the seventh inning now, and we'll see here. Yeah, they're not going to deal with Simon Unger here today as he's just not worth it as they have a runner and scoring position here, and we'll see what they'll do, and they'll go ahead and say, yeah, Simon, go ahead and take first base. So he, that's what he's going to do as he walks over there and gets in position. Now go to the eighth inning here, and it's 4-8, or excuse me, 8-4, and the uh, L.A. Dodgers are in the lead, and this one goes high and deep. This one is going to go back, and that one is gone. Or excuse me, that one is caught there. Is uh, that is going to be it? As it's eight to four, your final score. As the Diamondbacks do not win that game, there and that is going to take a look here at some of his numbers there already here today. As he goes two for four in the ball game, a walk and a run <clears throat> by him. As you take a look here, there are six games left. There are three games at home. Uh, we uh, are going to right, six games at home, but the first three of those six will be against San Diego. And then finally with uh, the uh, Mets. Um, or she's not Mets, uh, Oakland there. Uh, so, yeah, we'll see how that goes here uh, in the next episode. So uh, we got three games against San Diego uh, at home, and then we'll wrap up the series at home against the A's here at the in and around the Bay Area in the next episode. So definitely come on back for more Road to the Show with Simon Unger here on ESGNet. If you guys have enjoyed the video, please hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more Road to the Show with Simon Unger. Uh, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Tumblr. The links are down below in the description. And as always, keep yourselves each other healthy. And I'll see you guys next time.